Welcome back for those who are returning, being locked in and engaged with a series of great questions. For those who are new to the channel, welcome. It's time for a fiesta of great content. You know, this is the one question I needed to get off my chest was, what's the one game you want your kids to play? That's a tough one, right? Because especially like, you know, you when you were younger, you couldn't really think about what, what was one game that your parents didn't want you to really be playing. They wanted you to go outside and be a normal kid or, you know, even if you're playing something like a chessboard. To, you know pass the time but if you could think of one game that you would want your kid or kids to play what would it be for me if i had one game that i wanted my kids to actually play would probably be spongebob lights camera action dumbass yes i did go there yes i did say that game because it was actually a great game when it came out right the you know that fun activities it was multiplayer which gives you plenty of room to play with your friends or even you know if your kids are playing they could play with their friends um, or even just a family night of just having some fun right especially you know that it's a type of game where you know that you're not going to really want to throw your controller at your fat back tv you know the big tvs back in the day yeah at least it's not to where that you know that extent is and also it gives them the chance to really experience what nostalgia video gaming was like you know we all can't really see what the foreseeable future would be for gaming i mean at that point we're, we're actually living inside the game we already have vr experience but i feel like it'll get to a point where we're actually like that, that like that episode of uh, american dad um you know where they're you know in the actual video game like using suits and shit like that's probably where we'll probably get to but at least we can kind of bring our kids to the point where you know where we came from with pixels and you know hooking up your red white yellow cable to your vcr to get an output signal you know or even having disc you know remember that remember those or cartridges having the blow on them just for it to work sometimes because you know back in the day we didn't really have the advantages of like cleaning the cartridge you know all you had to do was kind of blow it pull your hot breath on it and try to fix it but that's really what made the experience so much enjoyable for us because we had to make do what we have and we can kind of show our kids what it was kind of like for us having to grow with that type of technology at the time and you know it did made, it made it happen man it made life enjoyable but if I had to pick one more game that I want my kids to actually play and enjoy it would be like Tom and Jerry for PS1. I have spent a great deal on this game in particular. I had no idea why it would made it so much fun, but I guess it was just a, the concept of like setting traps um, and, you know, get, trying to catch either Jerry. If you're playing as Tom, you know, you want to catch Jerry as much as possible. So it, it really puts you in the shoes of Tom um, the obsession of wanting to capture him. I, I don't know, it was just kind of fun as a kid. And, you know, it, it even though it didn't have much to offer, it was just a fun experience for me, just, you know, being able to like throw things at him. And, you know, it was such a small concept of a video game, but, you know, that's the stuff that kind of makes it more enjoyable that you don't put too much thought behind the art itself. So that's just my opinion of what I will want my kids to actually play. What will be the, the game that you guys will want your kids to actually play? You know, not only to get like a connection between you and your kids, of course, but, you know, to, to also enjoy the ex experience behind, you know, playing the game. You know what I mean? Like what would be a fun activity game to for you and your family to enjoy? And with that question being asked, you know, when you think about these type of games going back, like, is it one of the games that you feel like should be brought back in today's, you know, video game culture? And, you know, 
do we start to need more games like that going forward? Let us know in the comments section, you know, definitely let, I, I kind of want to know what you guys actually opinions on this question and leave a like on the video. Really appreciate all the hard work we put into these videos and show some support by subscribing to the channel. Really do appreciate it, guys. And with that being said, we'll see you guys in the next video.